what's up YouTube? This is OK Chief, and I'm here with another I Got Mail video from one of my really, really, really good friends, Gary GeForce Voigt. Now, I am doing this completely, and I mean completely ass backwards from the uh, recommendation of Gary. <laughs> Man, I can't begin to tell you how I fucked this up. I, I'm not going to straight up and I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I fucked up. Is that what you wanted me to say? Is that is that how you wanted me to I can't. I, I fucked up. I fucked up. And I want to tell Gary that I'm sorry. I fucked up. And let me explain to you how I fucked up. Um, This is Gary's package. No pun intended. He sent it to us. And uh, I, we, me and Will, we, it was addressed to both of us. He had told me prior. Um, I told Will he needed to get over here because this was uh, something involving him. He, there was something in here for him. Will came over. As you know, Will works like all week. And the only time we really get to do anything uh, video-wise is on the weekends, on Saturdays and Sundays. So um, I had him come over on a Saturday. And we filmed Gary's uh, video. Um, he received something in here from Gary, to which I will be explaining here in a second, but, um, we did the video, everything went dandy, we went about our business for that day, um, I went to go upload it, took out the chip from the camera, the, the SD card, and I put it to, um, the computer, and it, it wasn't on there, well, like, maybe five minutes of it was on there. Or three or four minutes was of it was of, of it on there. What happened was the damn disc ran out of memory while we were recording. We totally didn't even know that it had stopped recording. We just kept on going the way we always do. <laughs> we totally didn't even know. That as soon as we finished, I closed up the the camera. We went about our business game chasing that day. Uh, we used another camera. And we didn't think about nothing of it until I went to go upload the video. And when I went to go upload the video, god dang it, if it wasn't there. So I was really pissed because on the way game chasing, Gary has sent a couple of gu uh, gummy bear things in here that I will tell you in a minute here. Um, and we ate those on the way to game chasing, so I can't show you those unless you want to see the after show of how they were. So, I don't think nobody wants to see that, so I'm just going to tell you what was in there. But, I want to get to Gary, what it was Gary sent me, and then I'll explain to you what he gave to Will, which Will will be showing you in his, on his birthday. So, I'm, I'll, I'm, it'll make sense here in a minute. So, Gary sent me this, we opened it up, like this. Ho, ho, ho! I still have everything else that Gary sent me in here. He sent a note, which I will be rereading once again. What's up, Chief? Sup, Will? Fellas, inside you will find a bunch of randomness, but I feel there needs to be more food in your unboxing videos. So, I have enclosed some of my favorite gummy bears for you guys to munch on. All I ask is that you open up the o the the wrapped items last. I hope you and Will enjoy this epically awesome box of epic awesomeness, your friend Gary G. Force Voigt. I don't have to explain to you guys how awesome Gary Voigt is. I'm serious. Gary Voigt has to be clearly like one of my number one fans. Not just a fan anymore. He has become a really, really close friend to me. We message each other all the time. Whenever um, Gary finds something, dude, let me tell you, Gary finds some wicked awesome stuff. He's on YouTube. If you haven't checked him out already, I'm pretty sure you've already have. I've sent you a lot of people over his way, and I want people to keep going over there because I want Gary's um, finds to be noticed. He finds some wicked awesome stuff at Goodwill. I get jealous of some of the stuff he found at Goodwill. In fact, some of the stuff he found in Goodwill pertains to being here so I want to show you that here in a second first I want to tell you how most of this stuff came it all came inside of uh, Ziploc bags sandwich Ziploc bags I already took the liberty of ex of taking out everything he took and putting it all into cases and I'm gonna show you here in a minute 
so I want to get to, I'll leave the cool, coolest item he sent. Oh my god, I flipped balls when I saw this. So first we're going to get to the games. We'll leave that here. Uh, he sent Major League Baseball 2K5. He sent another. Is that Derek Jeter? Yes, yeah, sure as hell's Derek Jeter. Another Major League Baseball 2K5. He sent an NBA, EA Sports NBA Live 06 and a Xbox Developers Cut Burnout 2 Point of Impact. Now, mind you, all these were still just cover, manual, and game. All these have their game in there and the manual, and I took the liberty of putting them in these cases, so now they are complete. So thank you, Gary, for that. He also sent these. I these came just like how these were. This is what they came in, just like this. But these didn't have a game, so I didn't put them in the disc yet or in a case yet because I still need to find the games for them. And they are. This one is Destroy All Humans 2 with cover and manual. And we have Medal of Honor Rising Sun for the PlayStation 2 and a manual for the iToy. So, when I find the discs to these, I will be putting them also in cases. But this is how they came. All of them came like this. And it took me a really, really long time to put them all in cases. Because I had to get the cases and get the best ones so that I can have these go into my collection. So here are all the PlayStation 2 games that Gary sent. We've got NCAA Football 2002. Madden 05, Madden 03, remember these were all just cases and manuals and discs only. All these games are in here. Lemony Snicket's A Series of Unfortunate Events, Harvest Moon Save the Homeland, a lot of people love this game. And a lot of people love the, the, the Nintendo handheld versions of it too. Yourself Fitness. You trying to tell me something, Gary? And we have Trans World Surf. We have NFL 2K3. Ghost Recon 2. And lastly, we have World Championship Poker. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. And then this one. He showed me a picture of this. He sent it to me when he found He actually found a couple copies. I couldn't believe he found them because this is such a new system. that they're, And it's still sealed. And the fact that he found it at a Goodwill, I mean, uh, wow. Like, how are these people, like, how the hell did this get to, to Goodwill? And it's a Wii U Ninja Gaiden 3 Razor's Edge. And as you can see from the shimmer, that is sealed. Um... Couldn't believe it. Could not believe this came sealed in a Goodwill. And he found a bunch of copies. So, oh, and that's another thing. Gary is very, very much active in my Dumpster Dive Nation page on Facebook. He trades. He's a verified seller and trader all the way. So if you need anything from Gary, you don't even have to worry about checking out who he is. Because he is OK Chief Stamped Approved. Um, the A. He is stamped, approved, verified. Do not question him. Questioning him would be on contestation against me. I said, I don't know if I said that right. I saw that on a Knight's Tale. Check it out. That was. I always wanted to use that phrase. So, <laughs> questioning me is beyond contestation. Uh, that's an awesome word. I thought that was wicked awesome. Okay, next we have all these games loose. And I will not go through them all here in front of you. I'm going to set them up so that I can show you them a lot better. But check out all those games. There's a lot of games in here. So and these came in a sandwich bag as well. So I'm going to get all these laid out to you. There's one more thing that I think you guys are going to love. And this is the stuff that I love. And Gary knows it and everyone else out there knows it. I love oddities, and this, everyone, is an oddity of my liking. When I saw it with Will, if you would have just saw our faces, by this time, this was already like into the 15th or 16th minute mark on the video, which was not recording, 
But we were, I was happy, he was happy, I was happy, he was happy, he was happy, I was happy, and I was really happy. Boom. Where in the world would, did you, how do you come across something like this? It never ceases to amaze me all the fun stuff that people find for the turtles. And this, oh, it doesn't end there. I mean, yes, it is gorgeous. Yes, it is a Pez dispenser. Yes, it is a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Yes, it is Leonardo. But it does, the fun doesn't stop there. You want to know why? I'm going to show you why. Check it out. I hope there's no copyrights here. There's a speaker back here. See that? That's where the music's coming from. And not only does it dispense Pez, it dispenses full-size Pez. Look at the whole thing. You can eat the whole thing. The whole thing. Gary is so full of class. Gary took the time to fill all this up with Pez. If that doesn't get you over to his channel, I don't know what will. This is so cool, I can't even begin to say thank you so much. This has been displayed pretty much everywhere in my room. I have been trying to find the perfect location to display this awesomeness. Like almost if, like, if you walk into my room, this is what I want you to see right at first glance. This is how awesome this is. I can't stop staring at this thing. This thing is so awesome. I mean, every time someone comes into my room and they see this, they're like, what the shit? Where the shit did you get this? And all I can tell them is G-Force. G-Force. They're like, what the fuck is G-Force? I'm like, G-Force. <laughs> I'm telling you, everyone, I can't begin to tell Gary how much I appreciate your, your awesomeness. Thank you for being such an awesome fan, brother. I swear to God, I love you so much to death. And with that being said... The package that came for Will. Will was so happy to receive a package Gary gave him. He will show it. Trust me. I know this is ass backwards from the way you wanted it done, Gary, but trust me. This is the way he wanted to do it. So I couldn't go against his witches. I fought with him, like, for ten minutes on the video. Like, dude, you gotta open it. Gary sent it to you. He's like, dude, this is a one-in-a-lifetime chance for me. Okay, let me explain to you why he said that. See, Will doesn't really get presents on his birthday. His, that thing that gay, Gary gave him, I don't know what it is. He doesn't know what it is. Why? Because he didn't want to open it. I begged, prodded, and pleaded with him to open it. He says, no, it's wrapped like a birthday present. Well, Will's birthday is in March. It's coming up in the next month. So Will was like... I don't get many presents, if any at all. Like, the presents he does get are presents, like, for me or from his parents, where, like, we take him out to eat, or we'll go out and we'll pay for everything that day, like, like, like you know, the movies, or, or we go thrifting, whatever. We, that's our kind of gift. Nothing really to where we wrap anything for him. So he hasn't gotten something like that in years. And I've known Will for over ten years, so... I kind of know what he's talking about because I've been there every step of the way for every birthday. So I kind of know what he means by never getting really anything gift wrapped. So he was excited to see Gary's gift wrap present. And he did not, for the life of me, want to open up the present here. He wants to wait till his birthday to open it. And he was going to film him opening what Gary gave him on his birthday. And he would have been here to tell you except he's working. So... I'm here to tell you, for Will, that he will be opening Gary's present on his birthday, which is coming up in March, and uh, he just wanted to do it. He just wanted one present that was wrapped, and um, now that he says that, I'm probably going to go out and get something for him that's wrapped. Thank you, Gary, for that, when I could have just took him out to eat. But with that being said, everyone go check out Gary. Gary, sorry for this fucked up way of showing your package. No pun intended. Oh, and the berries, the gummy bears that he sent. One of them was a Smurfs, Smurfs gummy bears. Absolutely awesome. That's what we munched down on the way to the Game Chasers, or Game Chasers, Game Chasing. 
And the other one was a regular Haribo uh, multi-flavored one, the one that you can that we normally get on on the packages that we get when we get gummy bears. And uh, but the, the the cool one was the Smurfs one. I remember that one because I always would bite off Papa Smurfs head, and uh, Will always thought that was kind of grotesque. So um, Gary, check them out, everyone. I'm gonna go set this up really quick so that you can see everything laid out, especially the games that came loose. So give me a minute. Okay, everyone, here is everything Mr. Gary G4 sent me. Um, let's start over here on the left. Obviously, we have this wicked awesome Pez dispenser. I still can't get over that. It's so beautiful. So gorgeous. And again, does it make... Yeah! Nice. I love it. Okay, starting it off, we got the, the manuals for Destroy All Humans 2, Medal of Honor Rising Sun, a uh, Play Eye Toy, or an Eye Toy for uh, the PlayStation 2 manual. Uh, we have a Ninja Gaiden 3 for the Wii U, NFL 2K3, Tom Clancy Poker. We've got sur a surfing game, Your Self Fitness, Harvest Moon 2, 2K5s. Uh, MLB or yeah MLB uh, we have an uh, NBA Live 206 Burnout 2 NCAA uh, 2002 Madden 05 Madden 03 and Lemony Stickets unfortunate a series of unfortunate events which is I have never seen that movie oddly enough don't ask me why we got all the loose games. We got Ghost Recon, Splinter Cell, Fight Night Round 3, Dance Dance Revolution, FIFA World Cup 2002, NFL Fever, 4x4 Evo 2, Karaoke Revolution, Desert Storm 2, wicked awesome game. Can't express to you guys, if you haven't played this game, jump on it. Really good. Ghost Recon, Backyard Baseball, Medal of Honor, Front Lines, X Squad. I can't even read that. It says burst, burst trick wakeboarding. Okay, Speed Devils, Ford Racing 2, NBA Live 2004, Demo Junk pa Jump Pack, uh, Volume 12, Cyber Speed, Desert Storm 1. So really, this goes over here. Desert Storm 1, Desert Storm 2, and Matt Hoffman's Pro BMX 2. Love this game. Love it. So good. Matt Hoffman has a really, really good game. This one, and this one's part 2. I played part 1, so BMX 2 has to be good. Right? So, damn it, guys. Go check out Gary. Gary is so cool, so awesome. Don't just subscribe to him. Get to know Gary. Because that's where you're going to win. You're not going to win just by watching him. You're going to win by knowing him. That's how cool Mr. Gary is. Check him out. Check out what he gave Will in an upcoming video where he unveils his birthday present that Gary sent him early. But that's how he is. That's how cool Gary is. He's not missing a beat on anything. So to Mr. Gary G. Forrest Voigt, thank you so much, brother. Thank you for being my friend. Thank you for being such an awesome fan. Thank you for this amazing package. Will, from the bottom of his heart, says thank you so much. And be on the lookout for that upcoming unveiling video of his Christmas. God dang it. His birthday present from Gary. Go check out Gary. I'll be leaving a link to his YouTube channel down in the descriptions below. God, go check him out. Do yourselves a favor and, and gain a good friend, everyone. This is OKG420. Okay Until the next I Got Mail. Peace out, y'all.